Once upon a time, there were magical books called notebooks that held stories, drawings, and secrets. But where did notebooks come from? On today's learning video, we'll talk about the remarkable history of notebooks. Hi there! My name is Annie and welcome to my channel. Kids History TV The word notebook comes from note, which means to write things down, and book, which is what you read from. So, a notebook is like a book for writing notes. A long time ago, in ancient Egypt, people wrote on things like papyrus, which is like paper made from a plant. But the first real notebooks were invented in China during the Han Dynasty, around 200 BC. They were made from bamboo and silk, and they were called jinpu. Then, in the 13th century in Persia, now called Iran, people started making notebooks from paper. They called them safarnama, or travel books, because they were used by travelers to write down their adventures. But it wasn't until the 15th century, in Italy, that notebooks became more like the ones we have today. A man named Johannes Gutenberg invented the printing press, which made it easier and cheaper to print books. This made notebooks more popular and easier to find. In the 19th century, people started making notebooks with covers made of cardboard and paper pages inside. These notebooks were easier to carry around and use. Today, notebooks are made in big factories. First, they make the covers using machines that cut and shape the cardboard. Then, they make the pages using machines that cut and fold the paper. Finally, they put it all together and add designs to make them look nice. Notebooks are important because they help us remember things, like homework assignments or fun stories. They also let us be creative, like drawing pictures or writing poems. And they're easy to carry around, so we can take them wherever we go. Notebooks spread all around the world because people everywhere needed a way to write things down and remember them. They traveled from China to Europe, Africa, and beyond. Now, kids all over the world use notebooks to write down their thoughts and dreams, just like you. So, that's the story of notebooks. They started small but became a big part of our lives. With notebooks, we can write down our adventures and dreams and make the world a more colorful place. And that's the end of this video. If you like this video, please do not forget to like, subscribe, click the notification button and share. If you want to know the history of common items we use every day, visit us again tomorrow for another exciting video. Thank you for watching and may you have a historical day. Kids History TV